In Tableau 22.4, Tableau have made some very subtle changes to blending, and I, I want your opinion on this. As ever, let's get stuck in. Okay, so right at the bottom of the new features of Tableau 22.4, there's this small change that they've made to blending. It's essentially a UI change, a change that basically makes the uh, icon different for blending. So they've changed it from, I'll show you the icons in a second, they've changed it from one icon to another and they've removed the coloring that used to be there when you actually made the blending link. So just in case you're not aware what I'm talking about, uh, here in a new tab, I've actually got the web edit version of this. And the reason I've got the web edit version of this is because it's also different to the desktop version. So I wanted to show you all three different variants. Let me get each of them up on screen. Uh, here we go. So we've got all three versions here. You can see them on the left. So the one on the left here is the web edit version as it currently stands. The one in the middle is the old version, 22.3, and the one on the right is 22.4 desktop. So we've got a wide gamut of different uh, setups. And I just sort of want your opinion. Which one of these do you think is the most clear? I'd really love to sort of get your opinion on this and, and have it in the comments, because in my opinion, I think the middle one is actually the clearest one. And here is why. Uh, the middle one clearly communicates which is the blend. Uh, it clearly shows that it's the category that's linked. With the others, the only way I can sort of figure this out is by looking at this icon. And I don't know about you, but this icon is not that different from these ones. It's it's very easy to actually just ignore the fact that the the the, the icon itself is a very sort of small change. We're we're, we're talking about a maybe a five by five pixel area that we're looking to see some change. And although these icons are very different, it's just not the kind of thing you're gonna obviously notice. Whereas uh, this middle option, if I just bring it up on screen, I think it's so much clearer that this has a blend going on because you can clearly see the category has a link and it's also orange. And if you compare it to the one on the left, which doesn't have that color, then this is the best sort of uh, you know example of showing the effect of color because what it appears is that the web edit version hasn't been updated with the new icons, but it has been updated with the coloring effect and you can see that they are very different. So maybe it's just me. Am I am I making a big deal out of this? Is 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 this worse or is this better? In my opinion, I think it's worse. I think this this one on the left shows very clearly that color does help you notice that the category field is uh, obviously in the blend. And then if I bring up, uh, which one is it? 22.4, let me just bring it up on screen. You can see this is the intended change. This is the communicator change on the website. It's got the new icon and the color. And I have to say, it's just not quite the same. It doesn't quite work. In some ways, I think this is a really good example of a feature where I think the change makes sense in a different context. You see, if you are designing the interface for a future of Tableau that isn't currently publicly available, this change might make sense in that context. But because we can't see that context, because we are simply going from one version to the next, without really seeing a need for change in this capability, it's actually quite hard for us to really see the value. And so I'm hoping that's the case. I'm hoping that Tableau is changing something behind the scenes that means that this change makes more sense going forward and it's maybe a necessary pain, but until then, it's just a question that you have to ask. Is this actually better? The other thing I'll say is that if you're using web edit, you don't have the coloring on the left. So you also lose that uh, in a way. And so if you're using web edit, you probably have the, the worst of both worlds. You don't have the uh, clear coloring on the left to let you know that the whole data source is actually coming from a blend. And on top of that, you don't have the coloring on the link to make it clear that you're using a blend. And you also have the old icons. It's just <laughs> it's just not an ideal setup. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think. Uh, this is the change in 22.4. Is it a feature? Is it a regression? I'd love your opinion. Let me know in the comments below and we'll find out soon. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.